What is going on today guys, Tomcat here, and today I am bringing you guys some awesome news about the spring updates for GTA 5. Now, I'm going to go ahead and get some things right out of the way real quick, and that is the fact that yes, these updates will allow you to have multiple houses, which means multiple garages, which ultimately means more cars. And for somebody like me that that's main objective in GTA is to build the biggest car collection, uh, that is absolutely huge. Rockstar has also announced that heists will be coming this spring. Um, I don't know how much truth there is to that since uh, they've said that heists were going to be coming and haven't really um, come through with that. But hopefully we're getting them this time and I'm really excited to play them if we actually do get them because, I mean, the original concept of heists was absolutely huge and just the whole idea behind it was absolutely amazing and I can't wait to actually have that, um, actually have that ability to do heists online with my friends. Now, also, the High Life update, which is basically the next, um, the name of the next update, the code name, if you will, of the next update, is gonna add two new cars, the, mm, uh, i try and pronounce this right, the Masakaro and the Zintorno. Um, I'm hoping, I hope I'm pronouncing those properly. One of them is very, is very Aston Martin-like from the front, and the other is kind of a is kind of a mix of a Lamborghini Sesto Elemento, and I'm not sure what else they're trying to combine at the back. But the front is very uh, Sesto Elemento, and also another cool thing that they're bringing in this in this uh, update is, or one of these updates is, actually no, not one of these updates. The update that's coming next is the ability to set a no contact option in online races, which is huge. Contact has been a huge issue, at least especially for me in online races. I know that I get extremely frustrated when I'm in first place or second place or whatever, as the, whatever high place in the race, and then someone, when I'm trying to take a corner, someone comes out of nowhere, barrels into me, knocks me into you know eighth, tenth place, and it just makes me extremely angry. And that's probably my biggest complaint about online racing in GTA. And I definitely think that it'll end up being a lot more fun and a lot more competitive with this no contact option. Now also they're going to be doing a they're going to be fixing an issue where some upgraded vehicles prior to title update 1.1.1 or 1.10 however whatever you want to call it um, they're gonna fix an issue where you were only able to sell upgraded vehicles for ten thousand dollars I don't think I ever ran into that but um, it depends. Maybe maybe you ran into it. Um, maybe some people ran into it. I don't remember running into it, but then again, I'm not sure. Now, they're also adding a new gun, the Bullpup Rifle, which, they, which they're saying is going to be quite a powerful gun, and it looks really nice. It looks badass from the screenshot that I've seen, but definitely excited to try that gun out, um, along with all of the other... Um, along with all of the other things, basically, that they're coming out with in this update. And also, they are, they are increasing the payouts for parachute jobs, races, death matches, and, and LTSs, uh, for, uh, no, yeah, for less than four players, sorry, for less than any, any game that's got less than four players in it, uh, whether it be an LTS, a race, a deathmatch, parachute drop, um, they're all gonna have their payouts increased, which is awesome, it is absolutely awesome, I hate it, I kinda hated how they punished you for playing with less than four people, uh, in an online match, but thankfully they're fixing that, and, I went over a lot of the stuff that was important to me, especially the fact that we're going to be able to have multiple garages. I mean, that's huge to me. Um, also, heists are huge with me. And let me know what you guys are excited for in the comment section below. So if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave me a like. Tell me in the comment section down below what you guys thought of it. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe somewhere on the screen. Uh, down there, or down there. Not quite sure, because uh, the camera is going to be flipped. But again, if you guys enjoyed, see you guys in the next one.